Hey, Ryan. Uh, commiserations on the game tonight. A uh, bit of a tough one. Uh, can you just tell us in your own thoughts uh, what you saw out there uh, for the 90 minutes or for the 80 or so minutes that you played? Yeah, I thought um, at the start we started off we started off well. Um, that's how you want to start on the road against a good opponent in a in a good atmosphere. You know, getting some corners, getting some opportunities. So I thought we started well. Um, yeah, and then as time went on. Uh, we started to get broken down and they were finding lots of space and overloading uh, both sides, but kind of my side specifically and finding a lot of space. Um, yeah, like I said, with overload. So it, it became difficult and yeah, anytime you can see twice in the first half away, it's always going to be uh, tough to get a result. The first 30 minutes, it seemed like you were matching very, very well. Uh, there was uh, there was chances, there was opportunities, but that first goal uh, seemed to be a bit of a gut punch. After that, that final 15 minutes, just it seemed like you were trying to absorb wave after wave of offensive pressure. Did the game just kind of get a, a little bit away from you? Vanny uh, was talking a bit about uh, getting away from the game plan. Did that feel like that on the pitch? Yes. Uh, yeah, I would have to agree, as well as I think we have to show uh, more maturity as a team to accept that, okay, they score a goal, um, but there's lots of time left, and, and it just felt, I mean, as you said, when they scored that goal, like it was a, like a punch, um, and yeah, I think we have to we have to react better going forward if we want to be a top team in the league. Uh, we have to have the confidence in ourselves that you know we'll be able to score one, two, three more goals after they score. So, yeah, I feel like we didn't respond well. Uh, I felt like the guys were almost down on themselves. And, yeah, like I said, I just thought it was just lack of maturity on our side. Thank you very much, Ryan. Thank you, Nathan. JJ? Hey, Ryan. Hey. Okay. Um, just yeah, kind of further what uh, Nathan was saying, um, that first 30 minutes, you, you mentioned that, you know, they started to find a little space. Was it something that they were doing or was it, do you feel like you guys strayed from the game plan? Um, I feel like maybe it's a mix of both, but mm -hmm. yeah, I mean, they have a lot of quality in their top three, um, as well as Kinda behind them. Um, so yeah, they were finding tiny, tiny spaces that uh, we were leaving behind us and in front of us and just get, getting there half a second too late. Um, and yeah, at this level, you can't afford that. Uh, the, you said the, the first goal was a bit of a punch. I guess the, the second goal coming right before halftime half was like a kick in the, in the nuts. Yes, yes, I would have to agree. It was, uh, it felt almost as if we were holding on just to get to half. Um, and we you should never have that feeling. We should be the ones that our foot is on the gas trying to get that goal to tie it up going into half. Um, and ultimately, yeah, when you're scared, when you second guess yourself, uh, things like this happen. Right. And uh, looking ahead now, though, you guys got four straight at home. Uh, how big in the big picture of the season is having these four straight at BC Place? Yeah, it's, uh, it's massive. Obviously, we've done really well at BC Place. Um, for a couple of years now, um, and yeah, we have to continue that because obviously we are looking at the schedule, and I think there's like a six, seven game away stretch, which is going to be really, really tough. So if we want to be honest with ourselves and realistic with ourselves, we have to look at these four home games, and we have to take a maximum amount of points, uh, in them. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Safe travels. Thanks.